Hello Aquarius, how are you doing? Welcome to Silla Vitero. I hope you're well. All right, let's see what the messages are for my Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising signs. What is the message? Mother Earth, Saturn energy, that is beautiful. You are called upon to help with environmentalism. So I feel, I love this for you Aquarius. I love this for you. I feel like a lot of you could be in this energy of wanting to give. You want to also, you want to also steer clear of energies that may be like suppressing your, your, your motivation is what I'm getting. But I feel like you're, you're like a teacher. You're like a motivator. You're like a healer. You're, you think differently. You move differently. And I feel like the energy that you're bringing in to this earth, right, um, is going to is going to enlighten a lot of people and i love that i love the way that you are just bringing in education you're bringing in wisdom you're bringing in abundance for people that they didn't even think that they had there's something within your spirit that's allowing like someone that's like not as fortunate to really understand that they have a chance, like they have an opportunity. And I feel like this, this is something that, um, I don't want to say you were born to do this, but I feel like this is something that you do at ease. Like it's not pressure. It's not hard. It's easy. It's simple. The understanding that you have is so powerful enough to help those. Like you're just on a different level. That's basically what I'm saying. You're on a different level here and it's being magnetized. Like it's being, it's, it's needed okay it's needed so don't be surprised if people are coming in and saying hey Aquarius what do you think about this what do you think about this situation and you know your perspective is just needed here all right I'm also hearing like maybe uh like a mother figure needs your energy or you know needs some advice as well so you could have like someone that is like a mother maybe not a mother but uh someone a bit older than you uh that really needs some sort of encouragement around you okay that's that's what I'm feeling here. All right, so let's get started. Let's see what's going on in your love life, Aquarius. We're going to take a look at you, the person that you're connecting with, and the mutual energy for the both of you, okay? And Aquarius, if you are interested in a personal reading and you're wanting some insight and you're wanting some sort of clarity, I'm here for you, all right? Everything is below Silavi Tarot, all right? Let's get a little bit more in terms of how Aquarius is feeling, how they're feeling, and mutual energy. Oh, Aquarius. All right. That wanted to come out in reverse, so we're just going to let that go. Okay. You have pentacles here. All right, so this is serious energy. Someone here could be very money-focused. All right. Very, like, focused on money. Let's clarify that six of wands for Aquarius. All right. So... This is someone here you possibly manifested or there's there's an energy of like I manifested this energy or I manifested this person. You have a very strong connection with someone here that a part of you feels like, why isn't this moving? Why isn't this moving? Someone here has trust issues. I'm hearing loyalty. Someone here has some sort of trust issues or trust with their things or trust with their environment here. But Aquarius, I feel like uh, there's a part of you that's saying, like, I, I feel like this may still work. I feel like there's an opportunity for us to, to move together, to grow together here. All right? How does this person feel about Aquarius? How does this person feel about my Aquarius? They feel like... Wow. They feel like they, they have to change in order to be with you here. This is someone here that could have ended something with you, Aquarius. What happened? Someone must have ended something here. And again, take it how it resonates. It may be you ending something because you want to focus on your career and this person's still, you know, still wanting things to work. But there's an energy here of one person saying like, this is not going to work or maybe they're not putting in enough and they're focusing on other things. Someone is saying like, instead of me changing, I decided to just give up. There could have been a conversation that, again, did not go according to plans at all. And someone decided to jump into a different direction or like, I'm just going to move forward. Wow, I have to dig into this one. This one's interesting. Show me Aquarius's energy towards what's happening right now. 
Yeah, so you're a little bit in, like, you're, you're in limbo a little bit. You're trying to figure out, like, why does this person, why does this person even want me? Or, or what does this person want from me? Let's get a little bit more on that. Okay, so I feel like your intuition is telling you that this is someone here that's going to return, but I keep getting something with trust. So for some of you, you may not completely trust this person. Um, you're willing to give them another chance here. You're willing to, you know, work on things with them because I, I really get this energy of you not really moving forward or someone's not moving forward here. Someone is saying like, I'm willing to talk things out. I'm willing to give this another chance again. And again, it's it's not over. I just don't get that it's over here. What's going on with this person? Just be very careful that you're not connecting with someone that's just a taker, that just wants to take. Okay, so this person's open to communication. So expect some sort of communication coming in here. There could be something about traveling. There could be something about, hey, this is how I felt about our conversation. Or this is how I felt. Or this is why I haven't been communicating. So someone here may try to express to you why they haven't been communicating. There could have been a misunderstanding as well. A slight misunderstanding here. All right. I'm also seeing like someone's family member being involved or talk about someone's family or there's something about family here coming in all right and that could be exactly where someone's trust issues are coming from okay and just be very careful who you're getting advice from all right For, especially if it's a cross watcher that's watching this because i feel like there's a deep misunderstanding or a mis like a miscommunication that happened at some point and i feel like you'll have the opportunity to clear things up right there could be something about traveling towards one another Okay, what is this person's intentions towards Aquarius? Someone here really wants to talk it out. Like, let's talk it out. Yeah, there's the world there. I'm also hearing something about, like, sexual energy. Like, someone here is still holding on to that sexual energy here. Or that's something that I still want to keep. Be very careful of situationships. I mean, if that's what you're into, then cool. But if you're not wanting that... There's an energy of a situationship coming in here of someone still wanting to be like sexually connected to you, but not really, um, not really coming in with a solid offer. That's what I'm getting. But I do feel like this is someone here in the next three weeks, two to three weeks here. I see a conversation happening. We have eight. So again, this could be in August here where um, some impulsive communication comes in very quickly. Yeah, they want to offer you something. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Let's talk about it. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo as well. What is this person offering? Yeah, but someone here, it's like, I want things my way or no way also. Right? I want things my way or no way. How does Aquarius show up here? That could be you here. You're So this is you, Aquarius. You're actually showing up with this energy of... This is what I feel comfortable with. And this is what I don't feel comfortable with. And I feel like someone's actually going to respect it, especially if it's delivered with love and it's delivered with kindness, but stern and to the point. Someone here, it's like they sort of surrender, right? They sort of surrender and they're like, I understand. So there's something about the way that you're going to communicate to this person that's going to give them this, um, you know, this emotional clarity. Like, okay, you know what? I'm, I'm. I'm not playing fair here, okay? And you feel like you're going to make this person, I feel like you're going to make this person prove themselves here. Show me anything else coming in for Aquariuses when it comes to love. Wait. Side note, Aquarius. I'm also seeing like this job offer coming in for you or this opportunity that's coming in for you that you may actually reject. Something about your intuition is not, you don't like it. Okay, let's get a little bit more for love. Anything else coming in for love for those that are no longer connecting with this? Yeah, working on yourself at this time here. Some of you are still in a place where you have to shut something out and you have to let things go here. Okay, and also be very steer clear of those that are like not completely over heartbreak and not completely over past trauma I mean, we all have past trauma, right? But if this is someone here that's allowing their past energies to still hinder and still, you know, 
still stand in a space where they're making decisions or again helping or or directing their decision making you want to step away from that i just get someone coming towards you as like a leech or someone coming towards you as if like aquarius help me aquarius help me and i feel like you pick up on it very quickly and you're like this is an energy that's that's not ready for the levels that i'm trying to ascend to i'll help them I feel like you're not going to just abandon this person. You'll help them, but you'll also realize like maybe this person's not ready to give. Okay? So yeah, like you'll protect yourself, but you'll also you'll also be there for them. I don't feel like you're clocking in 24 hours to see this person, but I do feel like you're protecting your space, all right? Any advice for Aquarius in love moving forward? Here, be honest with yourself here be honest with yourself i'm also hearing like when someone starts lying even if it's a small lie uh, that is something that shouldn't be overlooked here but also be honest with yourself why is the seven of swords here for advice be honest with what you truly want be honest with actually letting something go i'm going to tell you this aquarius and this may resonate for some of you this could be a libra a gemini or another aquarius a pisces aries or a sag there's someone here that really wants another chance with you. And I feel like a part of you may actually give this person another chance here. That's what I'm getting. I feel like this person's going to like try to give you another chance. Or this could be you, Aquarius, where it's like you're going to, you know, want another chance with someone. That's what I'm getting. All right. But I do feel like this is a good month for you. I do feel like there's opportunities coming in. Of course, you're going to use your intuition, but more, more on the positive side. Well, this is positive because it's messages, right? It's better to know than not to know. But I do feel like you're in this energy of creation and growth. Aquarius is like, move out of my way, everybody. I got this. I got this. Right? Like, I feel like you're just in charge, <laughs> you're in charge you're in charge of what's next for yourself you are now i want you to know that aquarius like you hold this world in your hand aquarius i mean you've been through all of the signs right you've literally been through aries taurus gemini you've been through all of that already you're wise and it's all within you okay so you're here for a purpose and i feel like i understand you want to help and you want to connect but there may be someone here holding you back and someone here in the space of not really in this energy of ascending with you, if that makes sense. All right. I'll talk to you soon, Aquarius. If you are interested in a personal reading, everything is below and I will talk to you in the coming future. Have a good one. Say you love me. Say you love me.